Hi there, so in this video I'm going to show you how to use PhantomJS driver in your Selenium Ruby test. So make sure that you have PhantomJS gem installed. You can search from multiple gems for this purpose. You can simply use gem install PhantomJS or if you want to use any particular gem tweaked for working with selenium or whatever web driver then you can do so now open text editor save one file with name demo.rb now type in require then selenium dash web driver here next class to include is require then phantom js okay now here create driver variable so type in driver then selenium web driver class for here choose phantom js now you can navigate to any website of your choice let's say you want to go to n.wikipedia.org okay now simply print out driver title here by typing put driver dot title okay now there is not going to be any GUI for this browser because it is headless browser so all the tests that you do will be visible on console only with phantom JS Casper JS or HTML unit driver okay so open your command prompt type in Ruby then demo dot RB So it will take some time go through the website and it will find the website title and print it on a screen okay so here you can see wikipedia page title is printed and prompt is returned. There is no GUI or browser instance here. Everything is done on console with headless browser. Okay, so this was a simple video on how to use PhantomJS in your Selenium Ruby test.